Yeah, for you to be able to develop a simple dashboard, we have decided instead of retyping a new worksheet here, we use the same worksheet that we used in our in our last lesson here. So in this case, what I'll do is just click here. We need to come up with a drop down list for this kind of record here. So for you to come up with a drop down list, we use we will select in this particular given fields that are in column here. So for you to do so, first you need to click on this space. Like in this case, we have selected A11. Our A11 is our set of friend where we need to indicate the drop down list. So after clicking here, now we go to data. When we click data, we normally have to call the data validation feature here. So this data validation feature, when we click on it, you see data validation. So this data validation, from that particular given drop down list in this case here, you'll be able to select list. So when you select list here, now you come and select here for source. And our source here is our district here. Our source is the district that we have in our given data sheet. So you just need to highlight. After highlighting, now you come and click what? Okay, so when you click OK, We'll have a dashboard, uh, a drop down list here that we'll be able to use in our case here. So, this drop down list, when you click on the first here, which is Western, this field will be the default field in our spreadsheet. So, I come and look for the drop down list, uh, the V lookup for this kind of data at Western. So, for you to develop the V lookup, you'll come and click in front of it, <clears throat> then you type a formula equal to V lookup. We type our formula equal to the local. Equal to the local in the brackets. Now you come and click where we have Western. After clicking, you put a comma. Now you highlight the, the temple array from Western. Yeah, you come and highlight from Western. Yeah, like that. Then before you proceed, in between the temple array, you need to put a dollar sign. That dollar sign will separate in between the range, the range of values. So you click here, you put the hand. So also here you put a dollar sign. Then here a dollar sign. Then dollar sign. So what you do so now you can separate with a comma. When you separate the comma, at least that particular given value will be seen in this particular given case. So when you separate, you come and put an angle bracket, you know, or we call it curly bracket. You know. Yeah, we put a curly bracket. So in this case, we will call, we will count the column index for this kind of value here. So our first column index for now, it will be two. We put three. Comma, we have also three, comma, we have four, comma, then we have five. Then from there, I will draw the curly bracket like that. So once you are done like that, now you can be able to press enter on our keyboard. So just press enter. You can also close the bracket, but you can press enter too to proceed. So in this case, yeah <laughs> So we just drag it in. The first, what it was. I'm going to be 19. That's why most of the people who teach about analytics are uh, listening to the young people. But the first thing to me is that.
that is equal to the number n11, then number signs. I don't know. So we want to be local. First type of local. Simple contact. Plus. Right here is name. So now from the beginning. So the blue gap is comma. I mean, they have not been that one. Yeah, you could do the whole I have to run on this one. Okay. 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 I'm <laughs> Thank you. 
I'm gonna be here for me, uh, here's something. One of my uh, love. Yeah, the first one, one on a long side, before you find a letter. In a picture the first one. Yeah. 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 Sarah, what are you doing? Sahara, what we are doing here, we are doing a data sheet and generate these values on. But the office program itself, it cannot support that formula. So what it does, it is the first value. And that first value, it seems to be wrong. So we are trying to do that. Our normal key. Our normal V lookup, which uses the false statement at the end. So instead of using the auto field, you can use the, the one for one value, then you can drag it to the other side. So that's why I come here and then I click, I type what equal to V lookup, V lookup. After typing V lookup, I come and open the bracket. So when I open the bracket, I click here. So once I click, I come and put the comma. Then I highlight my table. You can highlight our table here. Then comma. Then we have our column index is column two, comma, then false. Yeah, false now. Then you close the bracket. 
Yeah. I want to have another person. So in this case, I come and lock it. See the values will be generated. So this is for accounts here. This case. So if you change it, come, it will become 13, 14, 45. So not all spreadsheet can support the formula that you have been trying to use, but only the advanced Excel program that you can be able to support. 2019-2021. So in this case, when you look at this now, you can come and insert a chart here. So you just click. So when you click, you'll see insert chart. So you can choose one of the charts here. Like in this case, I can choose it. I like a, a column chart here. So this column chart, I just click. I just click. So in this blank chart here, I come and I click. When I right click, I'll be able to choose the select data. When you look at select data, now you'll be able to select. So in the process of selecting, you need to click add. So I click add, and then I click the first reference value here, which was the department value. Then from there, I'll come and delete the second series value. Series values, those are values that should be able to insert. To insert. So this value now, when you look at this, you can select it. So once you select now, you come and click, okay. And when you look at the X axis here, we are seeing one, two, three, four, instead of naming the, the deduction, like a job cross income so on. So in that case, you come and click edit again. When you click edit, you come and do what? Highlight these top values, then you click OK. So when you click OK, the value should be seen here automatically. So you come and close. <clears throat> Immediately when you close, you can easily now try to view as it will be able to change. To change. You see, it will keep on changing, changing like that. So in that case, you can easily insert the uh, title on our chart here. We just click here. Then we try to select uh, this is actually chart. So this one already is existing. So once you uncheck it, it will remove. But when you check it, the effort to apply. So here is where you write your title. Your title. If you want the axis, you can also select the axis. Then you can be able to write the action, the axis. But in this case, we don't want to insert the x axis and the y axis. So what we have done is just inside the dashboard. Dashboard. But in case you want to insert, you can also click here. If you want to apply some values also inside, you can still apply. We have that values. The data values here. So you just click, you'll be able to see. So once you just select here, you'll be able to see. So you can just select, then you put it. No, not this. Data layout here. You just click, then you can move it outside. But also, you can select this one to apply the data columns here. So when you select now, this kind of data will be able to be seen here. In case you want also the legends, you can apply key. And this key, you'll put it to at the bottom, you just click bottom like this. So it will appear at the bottom of the worksheet, of the worksheet. So in this case, when it's, once you are here, the tabs, the tabs they are there, but they are just buttons. So you can now be able to do us to come up with a, a, a shape where you can apply to the chart. So you can and select shape. So this shape, we can choose rounded rectangle, then you draw it here. After drawing now, you can be able to do us to right click and send back. Mm -hmm. You can send back like this. So as you send back, even when you want to align, like add other chance, you can easily align. Then you can add, you add other chance on this worksheet here. So you just copy the first chart. Then you can paste. So you can just paste. So once you paste, you can bring it here. Then you resize it. 
So once you resize, you can change the layout of this chart by right clicking. You right click inside, and then you choose to change chart type. When you click change chart type, you can choose this one, the way you want it, like that. So in this case, you can remove also the other uh, letter here. Once you remove, it will not be shown on our worksheet here. So it doesn't remove. We have our lesson here, so just click to remove, to remove. But in this case, when you click here, you need to go direct to this. Have more. You can either show lectures at the top or at the left. At the left. So in this case, when you look at this particular given scenario, even when you want to change the chart to circle, just right click, right click. Select layout here. You click inside the chart, you right click. Okay. Yeah. So you select change chart title, then you select by charts, you can be able to click. But that's how it should be able to appear. So when you when you are done now, you can just move it down like this. Then from there now, once they are done, you can also do it. You can also group them. You hold the control on the keyboard, then you click on the charts. Like that. Then once you are done, I will click forward. Now you have group. You can select group. So when you select group, we can also put it here. So you can select the key region. Then we go to uh, group. Group it's under data. Not uh, it's not under data. We have forward. Then you go to group. And that. So once you are done, you can now move this chance. So in case you change something, you can be able to see it, be able to reflect. To reflect in our worksheet. To reflect. Yeah. Thank you for two minutes. Okay. 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 I am Ron. Amber. Yes. Now let uh, Sahara repeat very fast so that you can also check on it. So here is where you need to understand here. We we just use the uh, VLOOKUP. Mm -hmm. Not specify two, three, four, or five. Because the spreadsheet itself it cannot support such a function, such a function. So what you do, you click that time. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Dollar sign. Uh, dollar sign here, you know. The other one in the corner, dollar sign, you guys want to get that. Now for this one, you just press. Uh, if I change accounts, uh, for accounts, you go new and then we change to maybe finance. And this now you go here. We want to make this data into a table. You know, I mean to... Um, and Insert, we go to insert, now we insert a table, I mean a card or everything. We choose either of this one. Let's choose that one, finance. Then, uh, okay. After you choose them, somebody, you can rename them. The, the chart title, that's a label. So before I select the data, now you add. 
Now we remove this one. We choose this data. Then we edit here. For the for this one, the biomedical one, two, three. For us to get the names, we choose. Then we can put that one. Okay. Then we say, okay. Then if you change here again to another department computer, then we can also, what is this one? You can yeah, customize to uh, okay. this one, what I could choose automatically. Okay. Or oh, if I want to. It's still right, finance. I uh, will catch. Yeah. This is a must you type of finance. Ben Skuski. So what I was explaining is this kind of data here is free and low data. So you can choose a suitable title that can be trained for this kind of data. So so that if someone wants to analyze it, you can she he or he can be able to analyze. You can also just say it at the end, basic. Oh, that's how you add a chat uh title. So when you look at these finance people, they have a lot of data at this point. Ah. Yeah, no, no, I'm not aggressing. I'm not looking at Karen. Karen, it takes a lot. <laughs> I don't know which department I'm working in. So in that case, that's how I should be able to. So you just want to have access to the system, then you add the access. Access data. You add the access of clicking here. Yeah. Hmm. Uh, can you control? We are seeing uh, your. Go ahead. Add the pie chart and the other things. Then we move on to another. No, I want to start from here. Okay, no problem. You call to install. Oh. You can remove the chat so that the next idea you can start a fresh one. Is there a cut to the last one? Best. Someone to delete. I can't see delete. Where is delete? To delete from your side too. I tell you to delete it. Yeah, delete your phone.
Number of column, column index? Two, three, one. Number of two. No, it's two, three, four, senior. This one does not use this one. It supports your program. Finance is uh, four, yeah? Apana, we are looking at the the columns and the GIF gross income. So it's uh so choose two and the GIF from a either yeah two. Yeah, I did, but what was the problem? No, ni me saw comma comma two. Enter. That's right, yeah. Yeah, enter. And the E comma is gonna come and be the A8. I forgot even the A8. A8. A8 that will come on my finger. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let's see. So, insert a column. Chat. Who is the only one? Isn't the chat recommended chat? Let me get an idea. Or we can use this three D one. Okay. Now, uh, my choose now. You need to insert the data here. Huh? About the right click on inside the table, inside that thing here. Okay. Go to select data. Select data. Select data. Add. Choose that one as uh, this one. That one is here. Here. Oh, I choose. You choose now the on the drop down. You choose one. On the series name, it's on the drop down list. Apple. Apple. <laughs> either finance upper. Here. Now series value on a try here. All of them you put. Okay, okay, okay. I select this whole thing. Apana. That one already you have put it in the drop down list. Don't choose all of it. Just choose the the one that you can change on the drop down list. Oh, is it first? It's not. It's not the first. Ah mm -hmm. uh, yes, choose finance. Apo, Apo, pini kapsa. Yeah. No. If finance, you need to come for data. Yes. And then here we choose uh, the whole column. Now so you also have answer your number. Now you choose the column on the and and a finance upon belly. Yeah. Right? Yes, yes. Okay. Uh -huh. Now yeah, on the edit list you edit why is one to three workers, the levels from Ukoju, the child gross income. Uh -huh. There. Yeah. There you see, okay. Okay. If I want to edit or fill, now you okay. can add. You can add the chat title on Apple for chat title. Mm -hmm. You can add. Uh... Also, you can add access title up here. Add chat title, also. You can come edit and you can edit that one. <laughs> edit the chat title to maybe something like you can be a face list. Paste the reduction. My uh -huh. Then there was adding the background inside and add shapes. You can add shapes somewhere. So Go. I have to type the title. Yes. Yes, please. And there's no way we can just select and it keeps on changing if it's finance market. Is this a year? When you change the drop down list, it will keep changing. 
Moi, je dis ça, nul. Ça va. Il s'est acheté, il est venu à la femme, il s'est acheté. 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 Apa ju insert? Tukar ju apa sah? Ya insert. Now you choose a shapes apa? Picture or my pictures? Tukar. Si tukar. Oh yeah yeah. Choose yeah on the. Apa ju apa sah? Next one next the next thing. Ah ah. Table on your right. On your yes. The first one you went to. The pictures. Wait, let me cancel. Yeah, go here. You have a mouse, Cindy, so you can control from your side, I see. So, so you, yeah, it's not a stop control, you're supposed to, to stop control. Uh -huh. so only some time control. 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 Less than a minute. Right. So, and you have less than a minute inside the shape. Uh -huh. Choose a oh, that corner. Yes. You said you go back, send back, send back. Oh, okay. You can size it, then you can also add another. For comparison, for example, you can add either chart or a different type of chart. Up on Danny? Yes. This chart, you can find this chart. 